Teacher Laura noticed a student looking at her who was not interested in the test. His name was Danny, and he loved her, but she ignored him. Laura is a high school teacher. Laura goes to work on the first day after summer vacation. Laura gave school exams to the students in the class to work on, but she noticed that one student was looking at her a lot and was not interested in the exam. His name was Danny, and he loved her, but she ignored her. After the class ended, the teacher went to pick her daughter up from school to go home. While she was in the car, she saw Dania playing with his dog. On the second day of class, there was a girl talking on the phone and not respecting the terms of the class, so I took her. Laura called the phone and said, when the class is over, you can take the phone. But while she was leaving, the girl said to her, you dirty whore, which upset the teacher. She said to her, do you call me a whore? She said to her, rather she called you a whore, and all the students started laughing. The teacher got angry and expelled her from the class, and while she was angry, she also saw Danny getting angry with the girl. And after the lesson, Laura saw Danny through the window as he took revenge on that girl and started throwing her bike and all her belongings. Over the weekend, Laura was searching the department archives for his name to learn more about him. After the next day of class, Laura saw Danny's wallet on the floor and went to pick it up from the floor. She saw that he had his shirt inside and began to smell it. At that moment, she felt as if someone was watching her. She went to the school bathroom to wash herself, but she was surprised that Danny followed her there, took her hands and approached her. He touched her chest and kissed her neck, but she stopped him and said to him, you are playing with fire and I can expel you from school with your behavior. Let me be clear with you. I have no love feelings towards the students and go from there. The next day, Danny always looked at her while the students were studying and after class, he followed her. While she was leaving, he told her that he wanted to see her today in the afternoon, but she told him angrily that she did not want to see him and that he should forget her. She went to take her daughter home, and the next day of class, she began handing out test papers to the students and told them, if you have any questions, I can answer them. And Danny would ask them. He extended his hand to her and said, I have a question. She said to him, go ahead. He said to her, did you train with the manager to get the job here? The students started laughing. She got angry and said to him, This is not funny, Danny. He said to her, Do you lick? You seem to be good at it. She got angry and asked him to get out of there. The class, but he didn't do it. So she took his wallet and threw it outside. Danny was doing this as revenge for her because she refused to go out with him. The next day, she was exercising in the woods and she felt like someone he watches her. But she was just nervous because of what happened to her at school and in the morning, she was helping her daughter. During lessons, the house phone started calling, and when she answered, no one was talking. She knew it was Danny who was calling the whole time and did not talk. The next day, she went. She went to school to work, but when she got close to class, she couldn't get into work. She went to the school principal to take two days off because of her demand. She is sick and can't work. And then she goes for a walk to the river and eats apples, and then she goes to visit a photography museum. There she discovers that Dania is there too, and he is following her. She runs away from him and goes to the escalator while he was looking for her. When suddenly she entered the escalator, he finds her and goes in there with her. He tells her that he wants her to go back to school because he misses her and starts touching her on her face and chest. He puts his hands are between her legs and he starts touching her. After that day, she felt remorse for her husband. She told him that she was not feeling well and was having scary dreams and was afraid. The next day while she was at school, she entered the school archives section, stole one of the files, put it in Danny's shirt, and reported him to the police so that they could arrest him and take revenge on him, so he would be transferred from that school and dismissed the next day. In the study, it was clear that Laura began to miss Danny, think about him, and remember him when he touched and kissed her. Afterwards, Laura took her daughter to the library, but her daughter was angry with her because she did not buy her some things. Laura said to her, I will wait for you outside, but she did not come. And when she went back to look for them, she did not come. She finds that Laura called the police to look for her daughter, and they start monitoring the security cameras. Laura was surprised that Danya was there too. He was always following her. At that moment, 
she received a call from her husband who told her that her daughter was with him at home and that she had returned home alone and was angry with her. Laura told police she was sorry to bother them. With her because she found her daughter and she's with her husband now. Laura went back to eat with her daughter and husband and at night, while she was sleeping, she started hearing someone's voice in her house. She went to check and saw that the door was open, so she closed it. And knowing that Danny was the one doing this, she began to remember all the things. What she was doing with him was clearly difficult for her to forget, as long as she was distracted. And at that moment, her husband hugged her. That day, Laura was watching Danny near his house and waiting for him to ride his motorcycle. She chased him from behind with her car, ran him over, and ran away so he could let her live in peace with him, her husband and daughter. And that was the end of our movie.